A man accused of murdering his ex-wife from Guadalupe pleaded not guilty in a San Diego courtroom. And News Channel reporter Christina Rodriguez joins us live from Guadalupe with more on this developing story. Christina? Here in Guadalupe, hearts are broken after the death of Leva Orejel Garcia, who was found dead in her car on the 4th of July in San Diego County. This case, Mr. Luna, is uh, currently in custody. Uh, the matter set at no bail. People Germán Luna Salazar pleaded not guilty of first-degree murder of his ex-wife, Leva Orejel Garcia, at his arraignment in San Diego County. There's a lot of relief with the remaining part of the family and a lot of relief as far as for our residents here in Guadalupe uh, that this person has been apprehended. Guadalupe Police Chief Michael Cash says he hopes the community rallies around Orejel's two daughters who lost both parents in this situation. You got these children who lost both parents, mother and father. Luna Salazar was last seen walking away from the vehicle where the body was found in San Isidro. Uh, Mr. Salazar submitted himself to custody to U.S. Border and Customs officials at the San Isidro Port of Entry. San Diego Homicide Unit Lieutenant Steve Shablowski says this was a tragic case of domestic violence. Uh, he ultimately was booked into jail for an outstanding felony arrest warrant for the murder of uh, Miss Garcia, and he is currently in jail here in San Diego County. Police Chief Cash says it is vital for other families who suffer from domestic violence to not be fearful and to come forward for help and resources. You will get help. You will get resources. We're not going to turn anybody away. This is happening in, in the homes, and our children are seeing this, and we have to break that cycle. The next court proceeding will be on November 14th. The case is now being handled by San Diego's District Attorney's Office. Live in Guadalupe, I'm News Channel reporter Christina Rodriguez. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Christina.